Next, SoapNet presents poor Charles. He's mysterious. Here, give me that. Now you see it? Yeah. Ta-da. Devoted. My angel. Very impulsive. Don't! <laughs> now don't drop me! And definitely irresistible. Will you marry me? He's Rafe. Poor Charles Secrets. Poor Charles, coming up next, right here on SoapNet. Okay then, rise and shine. Up. Lucy, watch. Up, 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 up. Get up. Where's Kevin? He, uh, let's see, where did he go? He ran out of teal, or was it that angel glow white color? So he had to go. Um, let's go. Come on, go where? I'm, I'm not leaving before Kevin's finished painting the portrait. Well, I don't really mean let's go, let's go. I mean let's really, truly leave. I can't be the only one who has difficulty understanding you. <laughs> okay, look, I just found out that you are an angel, right? Yeah, so far. And supposedly you're on some sort of quest or journey or something that you claim you don't understand. Claim? Yeah. So as soon as we figure out why you're here, then I figure you're going to be gone. Which means instead of you sitting around just waiting for my husband to finish your portrait and not caring what happens, I happen to really care, so I want to figure this out. Let's get to work. On what? Figuring out why you're here and where you need to go. <laughs> Lucy, you don't honestly think that those ridiculous cards can tell the future? <gasps> Paige, I do. So shut up and shuffle. Ricky, Ricky, it's me! Yo. Jamal and Frank! Ricky, Ricky! Guys, uh... See, I told you, he might have already split town by now. In the condition you say he was in, Casey? Fine, so he disappeared into thin air, okay, Frank? Yeah, well, speaking of disappearing, where did you disappear to while we're out searching the docks? I had to hit the John. Is that all right with you, Daddy? Look, look, he's not here. Let's grab a quick bite at the recovery room and then head back out, okay? Yeah, that sounds like a plan to me. All right, let's roll. It's cool, so I'll, I'll see you all later. Well, you're not coming with us? Oh, uh, man, actually, I, I'm kind of not feeling all that great, so... Oh, all of a sudden. Yeah, it happens. Look, I'm just going to chill and hang out, all right? I'll catch up. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, it's minor, all right? Just, just you two keep looking for him, okay? Okay, if you say so. Jamal. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. They're gone. Come out, come out, wherever you are. <coughs> Ricky. Look. Gosh, you look like hell. <sighs> okay, so wait, you have the blanket? You have the CDs, you yeah, have the basket? Yeah. Okay. Right here. Got it all. Okay, good. So we're just gonna go in and enjoy a nice, quiet, calm, everything's fine. We're just gonna enjoy every single last minute that we have together. Romantic picnic. In our special place. That's right. In our very special place where all of our good dreams come true. I'm just trying to erase that terrible dream that Angel, you had about Angel, please, me. not another word about, you know. Oh, you mean about me being the fifth chair. Allison? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, listen to me. I'm very sorry. But I'm happy. I'm healthy. Look at me. Everything's fine, okay? And I'm in love with you. So let's go in and enjoy some of our time together. Okay. You're right. <laughs> I know you're right. I mean, like I say, life is a gift and it's precious. That's and while we like, things are going our way, we should just. Enjoy All right, it. both of you. Hold it right there. Well, what the? Don't move a muscle. I know how to use this, so don't get any ideas, okay? I zapped some soup from um, the fridge, and I got some stuff for your face, so... I'm hungry. Look, you're shivering, okay? Come on, this will help warm you up. Hot enough. Look, man, I'm just trying to help. Sorry. I'm sorry. Let me 
at you. Hey, look, Ricky. Um, I'm not used to helping anybody, okay? I, it's just kind of weird to me. I don't really know how to do this, so... Uh, hey. Wow. Oh, man, you are hot. Look, are you sure this is the right thing? Ricky, you sure this is the right thing? Us staying down here? Gotta stay. You promise, Case. Can go back to jail. Wait, wait, you, you promise too, okay? No dying on me. Deal. Okay, so you just chill and um, I'm gonna help. It's me, okay? I've seen worse, all right? Okay, just please. Let me do what I can. Okay. So just sit still, all right? Don't move. I'm just gonna. Uh. What? Hey. Um, it's not too bad. Um, I tell you, all right? Tell me. Is you have a fever, okay? And and the cuts and stuff on your face. Look, Ricky, you're you're burning up. Okay, we gotta do something. We can't just just leave it. It doesn't matter. Not Gigi. What did you say? It doesn't matter. No, no, no. You said Gigi, Gigi. That's your sister, Gabriella. That's what you call her. No, 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 no. I no. never mattered. No, Ricky, okay, that's not true. Ricky. No. Ricky, what are you doing? Ricky, wake up. No, come on. Ricky! Okay, I said take it easy. And I said to get lost, mister. You can go back to my parents and tell them I'm not coming home. And I'm not moving. That goes for me, too. Kids, you need to calm down. We're not kids. Oh, no. Um, of course they're not. God, babe. They're almost teenagers. And um, they're armed. Or he's armed with a very dangerous pitchfork. Right. right. Okay. You know what? N nobody sent us, and we don't know your parents. So, you know, put the fork down. Yeah, I mean, if you guys just sort of tell us what's wrong, then maybe we can help you. Yeah, right. Ready? Okay. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here? This is our place, you know. I'm, I'm sorry, it's actually our place, too. Yeah? Yeah, it is. So, you know, that kind of gives us something in common. Yeah, so, um, what is going on here? Why are you guys so upset? I'm not going, that's what's going on. I'm not afraid. His family's moving. But no one can make me go. We grew up next door to each other our whole lives. We're best friends, and someday we thought we'd be kind of... You know, together. And if they think we're moving and not going to get to see each other again for a long time? Uh-uh, no way. Okay, okay, I, I understand. Okay, but, you know, you guys, there's, there's lots of things that you can do to stay connected even if you're not together. Yeah, that's what they say, too. You just don't understand what it's like to have your best friend leave you forever. Actually, sweetie. Actually, yeah. We do. Lucy, you're out of your mind if you actually think that these Oh, no, no, no. I, I don't just think. I know. These cards can tell you what the universe has in store, what it has planned, even for someone who's crossed over to the big side. Yes, but I don't believe in these what, friends. What? Just, would you just shuffle? I cannot believe this. I'm sitting here talking to a dead person, and you say you can't believe in this? Well, I can believe in angels because I have evidence. I mean, I am evidence. But, I mean, to think turning over a silly card can tell the future... It can the future, the past, and anything else that's in store for you. Now, you just have to be very sensitive to the symbols on the cards, and I happen to be very, very darn sensitive. So just please keep shuffling and focus. On what? Focus on what you're most desperate to know. I'll tell you what I'm most desperate to know is why you're here. I'm sure you're anxious also. Right, well, it's obviously no use arguing. They right, are. Good. So what's the vision do? What's next? Okay, well, you did that very nicely. Hmm. Cut. 
the cards. Oh, very nice job. Let's see what we have, shall we? What? What is it? Oh, my goodness. Ah, uh, look at it. Look. And? It's the angel card. It's staring right up at you. Don't you see? Do, what do you think? A uh, coincidence? No. Think again. All right. Let's see. <gasps> what? What is it? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really sure what that means. Well, what means? What is it? Well, that's kind of a good question. I mean, my dumb cards came up with the angel staring at us right away, right? But, but this, I don't know. It's a young girl. Yes. The question is, what connection does she have to you and why you're here? Hope you're learning a couple things from oh, this, Jamal. Oh, my God, I feel a lecture coming on. Look, just sit down. No, why don't you sit down? Yeah, what do you mean, have I learned something from this? Would you stop giving me a hard time when I'm trying to help? Look, what you're helping is ticking me off. Besides, Ricky's the one that needs help, not me. Ricky got cut by those guys in that back alley crap game, right? Yeah, so what? So you were there too, Jamal. And from the size of that chip on your shoulder, you're lucky those guys didn't try to cut you up. Or maybe they're lucky that they didn't try. Right. You would have driven right. them away with your attitude. <laughs> And your new and improved personality, same thing you've been using to drive away most of your friends. Hey, well, maybe they weren't friends to begin with anyway. So what are you going to do now, huh? Chase those guys down by yourself for some kind of payback? Look, I know what I'm doing, Frank. I'm just doing what I got to do, just like everybody else. You know else. what? You're going to end up ratcheting this thing up and getting yourself killed. Look, Frank, you want to sweat it about somebody getting killed? That's your thing. Frank! Jamal! What? Hurry! What's going on? What? You found, where's, you found where's he? Oh, he? He's at our place. He, he, he passed out. I couldn't wake him up. This person is connected to you somehow, but the question is, who is that? But I don't know any young girl. I mean... Right, right. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe you don't even realize you know her. You know what? Let's turn over another card, shall we? Ah. Oh. Ha-ha. Look at uh -huh. that. Uh, what? Journey's end. Journey's end. Somehow, this young girl is connected to your journey's end. It, it's as clear as day. Oh, I wish it were. Honestly, I wish I could see what you do, Lucy, but I... <laughs> well, you might be able to, Paige, if you would just open up your brain and, and try to focus here, okay? I'm gonna do another one. <gasps> family. This is family. Wait. Something about your family. Well, that proves it then. I mean, they're wrong, or you're wrong, because I don't have any family. I was the last one. No, 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 that's not right at all. This is right. Paige, you're not the last one. This is telling me that you do have a family and you're not the last one of your line. You know, I, I lost my best friend one time, too. Just like that? Yeah, just like that, just gone. And there wasn't anything you could do? No, not to stop it. No, um... Bernie. He's Bernie. She's oh. Sarah. Oh. Bernie and Sarah. Hmm. You're really not making it up? Oh, no, 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 no. No, I, I, I really felt like I was going to die, and I, I felt this terrible emptiness in me. I was really sort of afraid that maybe he might forget about me, you know? But he didn't. He never could. Oh. And then I remembered something that he told me before he left. What? He told me that would never be more than a thought away. That really couldn't help me. No, but, it, I mean, it helped me. It could. How? Well, because she knew that whenever she thought of him, he would have her in his thoughts, too. And in his heart. Always. Even if they were far apart? Even if they didn't see each other for years and years? And who knows, you know, maybe you guys could, like, end up back here together someday, you know? No matter how far apart they might be for a while. Because that's what true love is all about. I wish I could believe that's true. You know, this, this place is, is special for all of us, so why don't we do something to make it officially special? Yeah, yeah, a place where all good dreams come true. Like what? It's funny you should ask. Follow me, come here. Mm -hmm. See, now, what we're going to do is carve our names here. So anyone who comes in here and say 20 years or 50 years or even like 100 years, they'll know that you were together, right? Mm. And 
to always know that you two are in each other's hearts. So. Oh, look, I, here, here's a knife. You can use this one. Yeah. <laughs> you want to go first? Sure. Why not? I'll help, Sarah. Hey, Ricky! Ricky! Ricky. Yeah, it helps you, Ricky. Hey. Come on, Ricky, open those eyes. Yeah, come on, start shooting off that mouth of yours, Garza. Come on. Is he okay, Frank? He's not even close to okay. He's in bad shape. His fever's high. He's probably septic. Why didn't you get some help right away? Well, because he didn't want me to go and get help because he thought he might go to prison. Yeah, right. So, But you can help now, right? Look, Casey. just help him, okay? Okay, he needs a full-fledged MD. We need, we need to get him out of here to the hospital. Right, I'm with you. I'm with come you. on. Hey, but he's gonna be okay, right? And then... I got don't say end, Jamal, okay? Don't even think that. Let's go. He's in bad shape. That's all I know. Come on. Go upstairs. Guys. God. Please don't let me be right. Please, God. Don't let me be right. I remember, I remember, so I pushed him away because I didn't want him to get too close because then he might end up in the fifth chair. And then I know what Ed said, Rafe. I know what Ed said. So I don't want him to have this death sentence because, you know, we sleep together. No, not you, Ricky. Please don't be the one who dies. Look, keeping an open mind's one thing, but how can I when I know for a fact that I am all alone in the world? I mean, parents, brothers, sisters, aunts, cousins, uncles, all of it, gone. Whether it's from hard living or old age or, well, accidents, as in my case. Yeah, sorry about that. Listen, you may know what you know, but the cards know things that we don't even know, no. and they never lie. Lucy, it's impossible. It's Nothing, nothing is impossible, believe me. In this universe, I've seen vampires and now angels and, and people who think they don't have family, but they really do have family. Come on, bear with me here, Paige. Just, why don't you turn over three more cards? Just, what have you got to lose? Come on, three more, come on. Do it. I don't know why I let you waste my time with this. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh, what? What? I just got goosebumps. Do you realize these three cards are confirmation signs? Of what? Oh my gosh, Paige, you've been barking up the wrong tree or going down the wrong alley or whatever. Your, your journey isn't about being here with Kevin and, and having your portrait finished. Paige, this means that this is about you not being all alone. It can't be. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know how. That's a question we need to answer. But these cards are definitely telling me that you are connected to somebody nearby. It all adds up. You mean... You really believe that I'm connected to someone who... Yeah, I do. Listen, let me just turn over one more card, okay? <gasps> wow, that's it. The home card, that is the home card. Now I would stake my life on it. Paige, your whole journey is meant to end here. Somehow it's connected to that young girl, your journey ending here, and that somebody is in Port Charles nearby. the finishing touches here and <laughs> ta-da! <laughs> what do you think? I don't know why it does, but it does kind of help me, I mean. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. You're welcome. So as long as this barn is here, you guys will be too. And together. Like you guys. Yeah, like us. So, from now on, this is our place, okay? And nobody can change that or take it away from us. And our hearts will always be joined together forever, right here. Okay? Okay. 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 <laughs> All right. Now I better go, huh? Oh, mm -hmm. listen, if you guys need a ride. No, we're okay. Thanks for everything. Well, I'm glad we could help. And, and good luck with you guys. Yeah. You too. Okay. Mm. I'm already the luckiest guy I know. Well, I'm as half as lucky as I am. Because I'm right here with you. In the place where all good dreams happen. Hmm. So, what do you think? 
I think you're a really good kisser. Oh, you're just now noticing it? Well, it just gets better every time. I love you. I never get sick of hearing that. Well, good. Um, but really what I was talking about when I asked you, what do you think? I was talking about the kids. What do the, you think the kids? About, yeah. Do you think that they'll remember? Do you think that their hearts will stay together? You mean like us? Yeah, just like us. Not a doubt in my mind. Then let's make a pact to, okay, our own commitment. For now and for all time. Yeah. Reeve, will you marry me? Stay tuned for scenes from the next Port Charles, Secrets. On the next Port Charles. Where do you think you're going? I'll never forgive you for this. You turned me in. Glad you could make it. Well, it sounded pretty important. It's very important. Legacy of the Ryan family with back to back episodes of Ryan's Hope. Then don't miss All My Children, only on Soapnet. <laughs>